Hello, we just landed in New York. I came on in, I tried to unpack, but I'm just too excited for tonight. Welcome back to a week in my life in New York City, or a, what is this, I don't know, a weekend? I don't even know what this is, it's Thursday. Whatever you wanna make, it. it's a vlog. I was in Florida visiting family for my brother's graduation party, Mother's Day, all the things. Tonight, we are going to the red carpet launch party for the Sports Illustrated Swim Issue launch. I was freaking out when I got invited. I was actually with Delaney a couple weeks ago when I got invited and Delaney like has been obsessed with Sports Illustrated for years and she would always talk about it when we were in college and she would get really excited when the cover launched so it got really, me really into it and then I was with her when I got invited and they were like you could bring a plus one so it all just made sense for me and Delaney to go tonight. So we're really excited they just launched or they just announced a couple days ago who the covers are. It's Megan Fox, Martha Stewart. Uh, Kim Petras and Brooks Nader. So very excited. It's at the Hard Rock Hotel. I'm getting glam. We're doing hair and makeup, baby, because I think this, I'm I'm so excited. I'm so honored to be there. And I don't know. I'm just really excited. I haven't gotten glam in a minute, and I was like, this is such a fun excuse. So we're gonna start getting ready soon. I just showered. I have eye patches on. I got kava to eat for dinner in a little bit. Here are my outfit options. I tried to unpack, but I was just like. I can't do that right now. This is what I would like to wear tonight. Um, I just tried it on and it looks fabulous. So I mean, I'm wearing it. It's from House of CB, it's red, it's gorgeous. And then I also got this dress as a backup from Revolve. It's a nice one shoulder uh, mini dress moment. Usually I do go for midi, but I was like, I'll try that too. And then these shoes I've worn many times. They're sold out in Revolve, but they're sick. And I figured those would go with either. So that's the vibe. And then electric picks. They were featured, um, their jewelry was featured throughout the whole issue. And so they actually sent me some jewelry um, to wear tonight. So I'm definitely going to wear these. And I'm going to try and put these in my second hoop if they look good. But I'm definitely wearing these. I think these are so cool looking. Uh, so yeah, I'm really excited, if you guys can't tell. Currently drinking electrolytes because I feel like I always get so dehydrated on travel days. And I kind of want to like drink a little tonight. Oh, they also said there's a special performer. I need to know who it is. I always just want it to be Drake because I'm just crazy like that and I'm obsessed. But it probably won't be Drake. I don't know who it will be, but I'm sure it's gonna be great. Delaney is wearing this brown dress that I wore to Fashion Week once and it's so chic and amazing and I'm so glad she's wearing it because it needs another life. She was like, do you have a bag I can borrow? So I'm like sending her. I think this would look really cute because it's a brown bag. Or I said this one and I was just like warning. It literally is so small. It's from Anthropology. It's so cute. It just can it won't like fit your phone. Oh. <laughs> and I think she wants to do this one. So we'll heart that if I could ever figure that out. It's 4.15 and I initially had hair and makeup coming at 4. And then I found out that the models are walking the carpet first. And then they're opening it up to everyone else that's coming to the party. So they said to not get there until 7.45. And I was like... I do not need to be getting my hair and makeup done at 4 p.m. But obviously I booked those appointments, so I texted the hair and makeup gals, and I was like, hey, is there any way? If not, I know this is what we scheduled, and they were like, actually, yeah, we could do this. So my hair, her name's Valerie. She did my hair during Fashion Week. Actually, the day I wore the brown dress, um, and I did, like, this slick back. We're doing another slick back today because I feel like the dress needs, like, a moment. Um, but anyways, her name's Valerie. She's doing my hair, so she's coming at 5, and then my... Um, Makeup artist tonight, her name is Sophia. She's known as Toland Makeup on Instagram. And I've never worked with her before, so I'm really excited. And she's coming at six, because she couldn't do five, but she could come at six, because she's actually doing Serena before. So, yeah, I'm excited. I just like needed that extra hour. I, I should have scheduled these like already in that way, but I just wanted like ample time. But then I got here and I was like, I need a second to charge my social battery to get ready for tonight. I like was nervous. I'm not even like in the magazine, nothing of the sort. I'm literally just like a little bystander going, but this is really cool to me. And I am thankful that I still get excited about things and I'm thankful for opportunities like this. I don't know, like Megan Fox is gonna be there. Martha Stewart's here, that's sick. Kim Petras, like that's sick. So these are the eye patches I'm wearing right now. They're by Beauty Bio and they feel really nice and cooling which we love and right now I'm actually charging up one of these these kind of remind me of hydrofacials it's called the glow facial hydro infusion pore cleansing tool from Beauty Bio I saw Carly Weinstein post about it and her skin looked amazing like it just cleans out your pores it's one of those things where it shows like the waste chamber this could be really I'm I'm really excited this could be game changing so I'm charging it up right now and I'm just waiting for it to be charged because I want to try it um, cause I feel like my skin needs some R&R. &R. Oh yeah, baby. 
we are getting in there. We are gonna be snatched tonight, my friends. This is such like an out of pocket way for me to start the vlog. I feel like normally I'm like, okay, morning routine, coffee, but I'm kind of vibing with this energy we have. I guess this will be like a weekend vlog because ooh, tonight is Thursday, which is the start of the weekend. Tomorrow, doing some random stuff. My best friend Caitlin is coming to town for the weekend, which I am hippity pumped about. Um, and then Saturday, I'm doing this really fun thing with Spritz Society. I'm doing like a bus bar crawl with a ton of my friends. They were like, hey, do you want to go on a bar crawl with your friends? And I said, yeah. All bars that like carry Spritz Society, which is one of my drinks of choice. So naturally very pumped. And I'm just so excited that Caitlin's coming this weekend. It'll be real fun. But yeah, so I have to figure out how I'm segmenting this vlog though because as of now, oh wait, no, I do have a vlog for Sunday. Oh yeah, so this will be a full weekend. Don't mind me just thinking. Okay, let's eat some kava so I'm not like lipstick on trying to eat some food here. I haven't gotten kava in a minute. I get the greens and grains, so I do the rice, arugula, chicken, avocado, tomato and cucumber, and I think that's it. I'm very simple. And then love how they give you some pita with it. Okay, it's not done charging, but I simply need to do this now because the hairstylist is going to be here in 20 minutes. And I just, this could be a big mistake doing this right before a big night, but that's okay. Okay, so I filled up the treatment change chamber. You use like a little bit of the concentrate and then dilute it with water. And then this is supposedly where you will see all of your waste, which I'm very much looking forward to. I feel like my skin's gonna be glowing. And they said to just like go with the natural curves of your face. And this, I am on low suction, I believe. But they said, um, I think if I pressed it again, it would go to like a higher suction. And to not hold it in one place for a while, cause then it'll like show a suction. So like I need to like wet my skin again so it can, Oh, I need to do my nose. How do I do my nose? I have no idea. Okay, yeah, I'm just gonna keep it on low suction, but this is very fun. Oh wait, let's check the waist chamber. There's nothing in it yet. Okay, just did it. You can see where there was like a little suction. I held on to it too long. My face definitely feels cleaner, but I feel like it could have done a better job of like putting the concentrate in there on my skin. And then also my skin does feel very exfoliated, I will say. Um, let's look at the waist chamber. Which one's the waist? This one. I mean, there's definitely shit in there. We'll play around more with it. I was also kind of in a rush, but very cool. Okay, guys, I'm here with Valerie, and Hi. we're doing some crazy stuff today. Look at <laughs> this. <laughs> I am so excited. Like... We're gonna do a braid. I don't really know how these things work. Do you braid it in or is it like an elastic? Um, it's my secret. Oh, hey, you got no. a booker to see. I'm Yay. so excited. We were deciding between a middle part or a slick back. She graciously showed me both options and I decided, we decided to do slick back. It's a collaborative thing. With yes, I literally was like, I couldn't decide. I go, honestly, what should I do? And she said we should do this, so I'm pumped. So that's my real hair, and then we are going in with the long hair. I just think it would look so good, like a long braid, slick back moment with the earrings, the whole thing. I gotta like figure out how to pose, you know? She's like, you better show the braid. I was like, obviously. She's gotta whip it on the carpet. Wow. Oh my God. <laughs> I'm so excited. Guys, don't mind me. This is so good. I'm obsessed. Sophia's here. Say hi. I'm vlogging. Oh my God, I'm so excited. Delaney's getting a little glam. We love it. Hello. Okay, guys. Sophia just left. She gave me some body glam, too. Really happy with how the whole look turned out. Realized that I won't be able to pee tonight. It was a very large journey getting this dress on. The two of them helped zip me up. But it's okay. The things we do. I am obsessed. So happy. Here's Delaney's look. Hi. Oh, my gosh. You look so good. The slick back. Hello. I like the low pone. Oh, it's, a moment for sure. it's so fire. Ah, here we go. Big night.
be happy right now. Yes. We just got pizza. It was so good. And Delaney's about to take out my hair. I started in the car and she's like, no, let me. Start though. I think I'll start. I don't even know what's going on back there. Guys, Delaney and I are having a sleepover. 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 I'm so excited. We just had pizza. It was so good. And kind of like a good little gossip sesh. We love pizza and tea. Tea. Got a secret. Did you ever watch Pretty Little Liars? Yeah, but it wasn't my favorite. Mm. They dragged it on for so long. Yeah, I never finished it. There was like 10 sure. different A's. I'm like, come on now. There were 10 different yeah, A's. What is that? <laughs> I am literally... I'm trying to like... She was like, so did the hairstylist give you like a how to take it out? I was like, actually, no. I think I just gotta... I think you just gotta pull and pick and... I only one body pin. Oh, because I took like four out in the car because they were like... It, this was very comfortable all night until the Uber back and I was like, oh my gosh, get this out right now. But tonight was so fun. We saw Martha Stewart. Who else did we see? We saw Machine Gun Kelly. Yes. We didn't see Megan Fox though. I don't know where she was. She must have she been was like, probably close by. We just yeah. didn't see her. We just didn't visibly see her. Um, oh my gosh, look at this. <laughs> I can't see the Evie Jeebies. <laughs> it's so long. <laughs> Maybe I should start with, can I take the right out? Yeah, whatever you want. That might be easier. Um, it's going to be so wavy. Camille Caustic and Rob Gronkowski. Oh. We loved that moment. That was cool. And yeah, like all the SI models. We hung out with Ellie a lot. They're all going to Florida tomorrow for the weekend for like more SI stuff. Katie Austin. Um, oh Your hair is like so stiff from the hairspray. Oh, she must have. Look at this. <laughs> this is literally, I get why they call it a ponytail. Oh. Guys, I had imposter syndrome tonight with that hair. I was like, that's not me. I was hitting people with my hair. It's crazy. But anyways, tonight was so fun. My voice is kind of going. Oh, here she comes. Oh my god. The whole hair. Oh my god, there's a lot of it. <laughs> I think she put two like packs. Anyways. It's out. Oh. oh my god. I don't know how to undo it. I don't think it's happening. Yay, it's coffee time. Oh, Delaney picked a fabulous mug. Feeling galley. Feeling galley. <laughs> There's nothing like finally being back in your own apartment making coffee. I'll match Delaney and do this. LOL. <laughs> All right, Delaney just left. I'm listening to my Tropical House playlist on Spotify. My best friend, Caitlin, my other best friend, should I say, it's a bestie-filled weekend, will be here in a couple hours, she's staying with me this weekend. I have gel in my hair, I need to shower. I want to unpack so that she could put her suitcase there. I wanna change the sheets. I didn't realize the lady was gonna sleep over, I would've changed the sheets beforehand, but it's okay. We're changing the sheets now, and we're getting ready for the day, and then we're gonna get some work done. I kinda wanna like go for a walk, but also I think Caitlin and I are walking around today. So, yeah. I'm literally doing everything else so I don't have to put on my new sheets. I hate making my bed. I saw this meme, it was like me after making my bed and you're dripping in sweat. It's a workout, you guys. But I unpacked, starting to look nice and clean so Caitlin can put her suitcase here. She's at the airport now, I'm so excited. I have to put away my swimsuits because I brought a ton to Florida and I'm gonna like put some away but then I'm going to Greece next week. So I'm gonna, I have like a pile going <laughs> in my, um, room here of like stuff I want to bring to Greece and this all cannot come like simply cannot but as I get things I'm like ooh, this is perfect for Greece so that'll be next week's problem but it looks nice and clean in here now I well you guys probably don't even I had stuff all here I got some like new products so I need to like go through that bed is made hallelujah I just did my uh, biannual clean or not even more than that clean out I literally like did a drain weasel cleaned out my shower drain because that was a little clogged so that was a lovely way to start my day it's looking nice and clean in here got essential oils going got returns packaged to bring to ups feeling good all right i showered somehow got all that gel out of my hair i just used the dyson air straight it's seriously 
is the best thing ever. I'm just wearing this dress from Princess Polly. It's a little t-shirt dress. Caitlin's gonna walk in the door any minute and she's gonna put her stuff down, change, and we're gonna walk to lunch. I haven't even been outside yet, so I'm very excited to go outside. Um, and I'm thinking I wanna take her to, I don't know how to pronounce it, Sogno Toscano. They have the best sandwiches. You sit outside, it's in the West Village. Hopefully it won't be too packed, actually. But I think it'll be great vibes. And then we'll walk around and all that and start the weekend. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. Okay, we're back now. Of course, left Zara with something. I this I got this whole outfit at Zara today. This is all I got. Um, Caitlin got some stuff too. She's in the shower. We both got this tank top. We got matching tanks because we really liked the square neckline. This is a size small. And there's a little like bra top in it. It's like a cami, so it doesn't, oh, that's, I'll have to tell Caitlin, that's really cool. And then I got this skirt. It just looked very, like, I feel like this would be on, like, Revolve, but it was Zara. I'm obsessed because it's, like, a little mini skirt, but you guys know I prefer longer skirts. So it's, like, I'm giving a midi, um, mini skirt, but then I've got this fishnet. Like, I don't know. This is definitely not for everyone, but with, like, some white heels. Wait, I need to, I want to, like, style this. Okay, like, this is such a vibe. I put on these white Steve Madden shoes and then this bag from Anthropology for a pop of color. I'm living for it. I have to make sure it doesn't ride up my booty. This is so, I'm so happy I bought this. And we also happen to be walking past Set Active. They just opened, first day today in West Village. I thought it was a pop-up. It's not, they're there full time, right on Bleecker Street. And I picked up this. I love this romper. I probably just wouldn't wear underwear with it, honestly. Um, so cute, I love the length. They had like a model like on TV wearing it with like a blazer. You guys know I love a jumpsuit and blazer moment, but I love it. I love a onesie. Okay, love this. It's giving She Plays Pickleball. I've never, maybe I've seen it on their website before, but I've never thought to buy it. It's like, there's biker shorts on it. It's like a skirt basically, but it's so cute. And then they had it next to the sports bra and I thought, it was perfect. Definitely more for like lower impact workouts or really this, I envision myself going for walks in this or if I hit my pickleball goal, <laughs> I will. But this is so cute. I really, I'm definitely very happy with this. So go set active. Okay guys, we're about to hit the town. We're going to dinner. And this like, this is just Caitlin and I. We just like, we just naturally just do things like this. Not on purpose even. We just happen to, we're not matching per se, but we're both like we're monochromatic. However, we realized we need a jacket and I have two of these jackets, one in black and one in brown. And it just kind of is so cute of us. And then she was like, do you have a really black bag? Oh, I'm sorry. And I was like, I have a brown bag. <laughs> Delaney's meeting us for dinner. She's gonna be like, what the heck? We yeah, did tell she her. Left out a little bit. She knows that, it's not like we're both in all black. No, no. Like, this is so cute, though. It just accidentally happened. It just happened. We're getting dressed together. This. I know this one, I really can't. Like, I really have to hold this way. Yeah. It has a crossbody. Where's my face? It's so cute. So, um, shout out your Abercrombie pants. They're so cute. Yeah, these are little trousers. Wear them to work, and they're really fun. For work and play. Yes. This I discovered, you guys. I said to Caitlin, I go, are these the same brown? And she was like, definitely. It's both from, they're both from Meow, and I've worn them separately before. I love I put them together. Thank you. Good. So, really pumped. Um, we're going to Soho House. First time using the membership. So exciting. And it's me, Caitlin, Delaney, and Ryan. Little well, girls' night. <laughs> Plus Ryan. Oh my god, she went monochromatic too. My heart. <laughs> You're on the pillow right now. We're home. Hi. We're both in our little like PJ sets. 
<laughs> You're like, oh great, the camera's on. <laughs> um, I feel bad because I couldn't vlog tonight. But did you have fun? It was really fun. We had so much fun. A cool vibe. I can't lie, you guys. I kind of had a mini panic attack. <laughs> yeah, we had to get we had to get through that. But yeah, it's um, I I'm convinced. <laughs> it's like I'm not sure. I am convinced that so we got coffees at lunch today. Think about it. If I drank your caffeinated Americano and you drank my la yeah. decaf latte, like I was just all day after lunch. I was like, I I didn't tell Caitlin, but I was just feeling like funky in the chest. I was just like, oh my god, because I, I don't really drink caffeine a lot, only if I really need it, and I did not need it today. And I was convinced, but I just like forgot it for whatever. We get to dinner, and I'm like, oh, you guys, like, I'm wound up. Like, I could not. I was like kind of freaking out. But they were the perfect people to be with. We, we figured it out. We figured it out. And I just like talked through it. Kaylin was like, let's go to the bathroom. We walked to the bathroom. I talked through it. I haven't had like panic attack like that in a second but it sucks i was like actually having so much fun no, we but i was so, so focused on my physical symptoms if you guys like get physical anxiety you know what i mean and then we were fine like i just needed to like get up move my environment and just kind of like switch things up a little bit and then we ended up having a really good night but it's crazy how you can let your i just i thought i'd talk about it because i should talk about the bad things too yes and but, your mom and dad were so helpful. Oh my god, they were very pivotal in the story. I was like texting them and I was like, and I don't know, some people could go back and forth on this, like their constant reassurance, but like, I was texting my parents and they're like, you're okay, you're healthy, you're gonna live to 100. Like, they were just like, say, I just need to hear those things because you yes. think you're like dying. Um, and it's so crazy. As soon as you like truly stop thinking about it, like you're fine. Like, we're just sitting here laughing. And I'm so really fine. thankful for that, but um, life goes on. So, yeah, we're gonna, we wanna like watch something funny. Have you watched Jury Duty? No. It's really funny. Should we watch that? Maybe. I like just watched it and finished it, but maybe just for you. But is it funny? Yeah. Do you know what it's about? It's funny. I'll tell you off camera what it's about because they all probably know. <laughs> You're off out of the loop. I'm a little out of it. <laughs> uh, anyways, we're gonna um, go to bed. We have a big day tomorrow, you guys. Yeah, we have to rest up. We have to rest up. We were like gonna go somewhere else after Soho House, and then we were all kind of like, but we could go to bed. I'm tired. Yeah, so, anyways, I just thought I'd vlog because I didn't get to vlog. Love you guys. See you in the morning. Good morning, guys. We just ordered bagels. I never do this, but I also got a hash browns and bacon, you know? So good. Let the day begin. Oh my gosh, I added avocado, which I never do. I'm so excited. Hello, you guys. It's Saturday morning. Or it's not even morning anymore. It's fully like 12.45. Um, and Caitlin and I are getting ready because I'm doing a little bus bar crawl with Sprit Society. I'm so excited. They reached out to me a while ago and they're like, hey, do you want to bring some of your pals on a bus tour around the city like doing like going to different bars that have spreads and I said yeah and we're ending at dinner at Ruby's so we're starting at Phoebe's which is in like Lower East Side it's on Bowery and then what foundation should I use I liked this one yesterday but I've been loving this Revlon one it's the Illuminance skincare I think I'm gonna use this but they were like hey you want to have some friends go around there'll be snacks at like certain bars and they let me bring like 20 people um, so I'm really excited. It's a, it's drizzling outside, you guys. And I'm sad because they actually got us a double-decker bus. Like, the ones you see going around the city. But it's Spritz branded. There's going to be, like, Spritz merch on there. And we were going to ride around and jam to music, which we still will do. But I don't know if we're going to want to go on the t on the double-decker part because it's, like, raining. So, But we're still going to wear cute summer darty outfits. I'm so excited. Um... It's mainly like, there's just all kinds of people coming. So I'm actually so excited. Some people I haven't seen in a while. Um, and then Margot Oshry, um is also coming and like bringing some of her friends. So I'm really excited. And that's partly why Caitlyn came this weekend. I was like, hey, like, always trying to find an excuse to have Caitlyn come. And I was like, this could be fun. Oh, you're done with your makeup? No. Oh, no. Caitlyn's trying the headband. Oh, yes. I've been applying my foundation with my hands recently. I'm kind of into it. This one's a little doing that light for me. Oops. I guess I got tanner in Florida than I thought. But nothing a little uh, bronzer won't fix. I love to pack it on. Um, but yeah, we're really excited. 
show you guys our full outfits when we're ready to go. Um, it was supposed to start at Watermark, which is on the water. I was really excited. But since it's drizzling, Watermark, um, like, emailed emailed the Spritz team and they're like, we're actually closing. So, LOL. So, I was like texting everybody like, update, update. <laughs> And yeah, so we're gonna keep getting ready and listening to music because we need music and unfortunately I can't play music while we're getting ready if I film because copyright. But yeah, it's gonna be a really fun day and I didn't realize that this was too light for my face because I was using it last week. Rock on. <laughs> it's fine. I mean, it definitely blends with my neck fine. I just love a tan moment, up. yeah. All right guys, <laughs> you would think it's bright and sunny outside, but here is the fit. Went through a couple options and everyone said, even though it's like gloomy out, I should wear this. Margo's wearing like pink pants. So I was like, okay. Top is Revolve. If I don't, if I forget to link it below, please remind me because I think this is a great top for this time of year when it's like still a little chilly on some days, but it's long sleeve crop. And there's adjustments in the back. Skirt is from Hudson Jeans. It's a little midi skirt moment. And then I went for cowboy boots because I don't have any like good white sneakers right now. My phone's ringing. Bag is anthropology. Hey, <laughs> this is perfect. This whole look is so good. Where's the shirt from? Abercrombie and Fitch. I love. And jeans are mine from Lioness. I'm gonna buy them. Yeah, they look so good. She wanted a good straight leg baggy pair, and I think they're perfect. Are those your Autrys? Are those different ones? So cute. Where's the bag from? This is called Pauline. Oh, yeah. You know what that is? Yeah. Our sister oh, that's so nice. I think they have a store in the city. Yeah, cute. It's literally raining. It's raining, but we're pretending it's like very sunny out with our outfits. Literally. It would be so perfect on this sunny day. I know. I'm so sad. We're going to make the most of it. We're going to make the most of it. Rock on. Let's go. Hi. What are you doing a weekend in my life? Yeah. How did you know? <laughs> <laughs> Isn't that like tie 
Sunday. It's a lot later. I like just was taking little vlog clips. I didn't really like chat, but Caitlin and I woke up and we did all of our cute little things you guys saw in the montage this morning. Um, she just left. She, I literally just said goodbye to her at the at the door. She's off to the airport. It was such a special weekend, and now I'm about to get a wax because I'm going to Greece on Friday. Or no, on Saturday, which is so crazy. And Taylor Swift concert this weekend. There's so much happening. Um, so I'm like prepping for that and I want to make sure I have like videos up and I'm just kind of getting ahead but I'm also catching up because I was in Florida last week. Um, but yeah, so the rest of the night we're just gonna, yeah, we're gonna get my wax. I'm gonna hang out with Ryan. I really like haven't seen him because we've had like opposite travel schedules. Um, so I don't really know what we're gonna do. I look have like so much to get done but like I really haven't seen him and I leave for Greece this week. So. Um, yeah, that's the update. So I just changed for my wax appointment because I realized that I was wearing a romper and so when you get a wax, you gotta spread those legs open and it would have I would have had to like take my whole, I would have been nude. So I was like, let me put on some bottoms. It's like 70 out, but it's always like chilly in European Wax Center. So I just put on this, the bar sweatshirt and this cute little Lululemon skirt. Um. I just, you guys know I've been having like knee issues when I was home. I went to a Foot Solutions place. It's literally called Foot Solutions in Florida. And um, I got, I have custom foot inserts orthotics on the way. But until then I had, I got some over the counter ones just to kind of start getting my feet used to it basically. I was correct. My arches are super flat and it was making my foot roll in and then bothering my knee. And so I've also been starting to wear these like they're like recovery shoes. They're from Ufos, O-O-F-O-S. They are literally the comfiest thing I've ever put on my feet. I'm really not supposed to be like, she was like, we suggest you like don't really walk around barefoot around your apartment. Like usually I'll wear slippers or something, but she was like, you should wear something with some sort of arch support. And honestly, I'm already seeing, like I'm not really wearing my knee sleeve as much. Like Caitlin and I fully went for a huge long walk around West Side Highway and I was fine because I have these foot inserts in my sneakers and I'll show you guys later. I learned how to do a runner's tie. It's like a different way of tying your shoes so you have more ankle support and I am already noticing such a difference. These are what my inserts look like. They're like blue, you cannot see a thing. But I don't know. So I'm really proud of myself for going and checking in because she was like, if you like hadn't come and you just would keep, you know. Oh, I also found out I made a TikTok about this. I always thought I was a size seven and a half. Like, you know, when you're younger, you're like, oh, 
one day you just kind of stop measuring your feet. Like, this must be my adult foot size. Well, no. I thought I was a seven and a half, but I'm supposed to be a eight, an eight and a half she measured me at. So I was like, oh my God. And I mean, my feet fit into a seven and a half, obviously, but she was like, the way your feet are supposed to lay and your, where your toes are supposed to hit, you should be an eight and a half. And I was like, you're kidding me. So that's what I learned today, but it feels good to be back in the city. It's been such a fun weekend. Oh my God, yesterday was so much fun. I guess I didn't really talk about it, but it was the best group, the best vibes. Claudia, um, one of like the founders of Spritz, she ended up coming and surprising us at the last bar and she was like riling us all up. She made the bar play Taylor Swift, which was so fun. And we were all just getting so hyped because a lot of us are going to see Taylor Swift at MetLife and this weekend. So it was so fun, I'm so thankful. Like I wasn't, like neither Caitlin or I went, like woke up hungover because we both went to bed at literally 10.30. So yeah, all right. Let's go, get waxed, my favorite thing ever. Wax went smoothly. <laughs> and now I'm actually headed back to West Side Highway. Ryan and I are gonna get some food at Pier 54. There's like a little food court and have a little sunset picnic. So I am so excited to have a like, cute little date night with him. Wearing the same, actually this is a Spanx skirt, not Lululemon. Beyond Yoga Tank, Lululemon. I got another color because I just use it so much. And this is the XL one. Um, so it's a little bit bigger and I think it fits a little bit more, which is nice. And then I just threw over the same, the bar sweatshirt. Sunglasses, I put on a little bit of my Sunday Riley CEO glow and some sunscreen and always sunglasses as a headband. So let's go. I can't wait. I don't know what I'm gonna eat for dinner. I'm getting hungry. I thought it was Pier 54. All right. Oh, yum. <laughs> So sweet. <laughs> I had start, caught, I started vlogging. So we just got back and we're about to watch this. One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest. My high school did this, Not I wasn't in the advanced drama program yet and they did it for a, as a play, but I've never seen the movie. Um, so Ryan wants to watch that. We're gonna make some popcorn. Um, but we ended up getting some yummy dim sum. And I just took a shower. And we talked to my brother because he just got back from a fun trip. Mm. Ryan's going to make us a popcorn. But anyways, I love you guys so much. It was such a lovely weekend. And I'm always so grateful for fun weekends like this where it's just a little bit of everything. I love you guys endlessly. Subscribe if you're new here. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.